Nice. Haskell, I never thought I would be able to complete this video, is another purely functional programming language which only nerds like us can understand. As it is maths, maths, maths. You write everything as a mathematical expression. I don't know how I managed to wrap my head around this, but I did. So this video. As a few <coughs> 3000 of you might have watched my previous video. You know I like to do two things when learning a new programming language. Learn X in Y minutes and project based development approach. And so while pondering upon a idea, meta release threads. And I was going to make a threads clone with a unique name, Freds. By the way, follow me on threads. I have a feeling I have to say this in my every video now. But due to some technical difficulties, aka me being an idiot, I couldn't create that app with the database and all. I did waste a few days just to get the latest version of GHC to install on my machine. So I had to come up with a new project idea. So the idea was to make a web scraper. I mean recently I have been doing this art course on artificial intelligence and data science. So this project kind of fits. I didn't realize at the time but it was a simple as project and I would be able to complete it in a few hours. Of course, I did understand what I was doing. Haskell is not as intimidating as other people put it. So here's a quick rundown of the code. So you know that I am not just saying Haskell is easy. I made a simple scraper that will get me all the post titles on the homepage of techcrunch.com. First, you set overloaded strings. It is a language feature for, you guessed it, overload string. As we store all the post titles in one big function. Yes, that is a function. We will come to this function later. Then we have all the imports. First import is lift IO function from the control.monad.io class module, which is required by the scalpel library, which is Haskell's web scraping library, just like selenium or beautiful soup. Then the text module and the unpack function, which as it says, will store all the titles and unpack function will unpack the text list of strings stored in the post title function. The main function is like in any programming language an entry point into the Haskell program and is compulsory. Your the main function gets the HTML tags from the scrape URL function which will take two parameters URL of the website to scrape and the scraper aka function defined earlier and return a maybe. Maybe is like an option in Rust it can contain the titles or just just nothing like ok or error in a Rust option and then it will match the maybe value. If it contains the titles, it will map through them, unpack them and print the titles to the console. If nothing is in the maybe object, it will just print that is failure. Conclusion I think the build system around Haskell, GHC and all is kind of weird. I think it needs a little bit of work and just make my project in the recommended build system and don't say you can't install latest and bleeding edge oops thanks for watching till the end follow me on twitter threads sub to this channel and thank you for to everyone who commented and showed a response on my last video you are the best